Well, welcome to my first stream. Um, let me know in the comments or chat or whatever if you can hear me, if you can hear music, if something's too loud. So, yeah, I'm just going to be drawing. This is my first stream, so I just want to make sure everything is working properly. And, yeah. So, welcome, or if you're watching this, as a video. I'm not sure if I'm going to make it a video or not, if it'll show up in my YouTube, but if not, um, hopefully I'll be doing another stream again soon. And just a little FYI, I have dogs that may start barking. I will try to mute it if necessary. So yeah, so let's just have some fun and hang out. And I don't know how long I'll stream because I don't know how many people will watch or um, if everything works out right. So, yeah. So let's just start drawing. Um, this is a cheap sketchbook. Um, I've had it a while. And I have my cup of tea over here. Um, this is my second sketchbook. And just trying to fill it up. The paper is not that um, thick, so I don't know if I can use watercolor, but maybe I'll try that. Not sure. Oh, this is hard because I don't know how to have my picture up and watch what's going on and try to watch a chat box. Maybe I just won't be able to see myself. And I'll just have the picture up and then the streaming stuff. So I always start on the right side of my sketchbook because I'm right-handed and I hate the left side and I feel like it's so inconvenient to draw over here. I guess I could turn my sketchbook around and then all my other drawings on this side would be upside down. I don't know. So.
This paper actually does really good blending. So that's nice. Maybe I should uh, move, try and get the camera right. So if I want to be over here, nope, wrong way. There we go. Is that better? Hopefully, and if I look down, I think that'll be fine.
the eyebrow is a little too low there. It's interesting because I'm watching the playback on the screen. Um, and then like I can see where things might look weird. So I try to adjust it. I'm so nervous about doing the other eye because they don't ever feel like they turn out the same and it really bothers me. Pouring rain. <laughs> all right, it looks all right right now. That could change in a minute here as soon as I start to put detail in. This would be really annoying. light out. Um, it's 6.45 p.m., but we're coming into spring now, so it's staying a lot lighter, and the window looks kind of bright, but it's actually cloudy and raining. Um, I do have a little bit of a light over my um, sketchbook, but yeah, sunset I think is like 8, 8 something, a little after 8 right now. Oh, and thank you so much about my portrait. Yes, I've been working really hard on them. Um, I haven't been putting out a lot of videos, so, but I'm still sketching and yeah, I'm just trying to get better and I still think they need a lot of work though. I hope my dogs don't start barking. What is it, um, so it's Friday night here, so you're Saturday morning, I believe, right? So are you just like getting up having breakfast or what's going on? And also, is 
Can you hear the music and can you hear me okay? Because I'm not, I wasn't sure. This is my first time streaming, obviously. And I don't know exactly how it is on the receiving end of things. But I wanted to try it out. Hurry back. I miss chatting with you. Okay, so let's get some hair in here.
want you to raise that shoulder part underneath the hair. That's very attractive. Still working on my hair though. I think I put way too many lines in it. And I never know what to do when it touches her head. Because I don't really think like that it's a straight line. It's more like individual hairs, but I feel like that looks so, I don't know, weird. Get rid of all this other stuff behind. These sketch lines. So this here kind of twists up and then it comes out a bit and then curls back in here. And then it kind of, like this is the other side of it. Ever working on how to do curls. They are hard. Here's one curl.
I got this other part of her hair that looks like it might have been blown by the wind, like kind of out here. Feel so much pressure here being on stream. here. I'm just sketching loosely and then it combines into this a little bit. It looks like she's got, it's hard to see, like one big boost curl maybe. Uh oh, everything's getting messy. That's not good. And it looks like hair, right? Right? Move on to something else for now. like a t-shirt.
you. I'm glad it looks so good. And the expression, yeah. I thought it was cute too. I found a just like a picture on Pinterest. The hair, ah, thank you, but I feel like it still needs so much work. Ugh. I wish I could just be better right now. I think I might try some watercolor. I don't know. The paper's really thin. And I can't... I don't see it, like, posted, um, posted, written in the book somewhere. And I don't have the packaging, but... We could try it, see if it works out. Let me grab some watercolor. Okay. So this is the Prima Marketing Tropical Watercolor Set that I bought, I think in February. And I'm using your brushes, Emma, because they're my favorite. Okay, got some water. I probably should have. Oh, that's not going to be a good spot. How's that? Okay. Ah, what is this? Get it off. Okay. So, here's my swatch card. I don't know if you can see that. So, it's got some pretty colors. Okay. What color? What color do you think? Kind of like this blue. I don't know, I like a lot of the colors. I like the purple, the pink, I like this green. Far bottom right for skin tone. Yes. Oh my gosh, you want me to paint her face? Oh, I never, I don't think I can do it a good job, I'm nervous. I thought about just adding like some color around her face. I actually paint her face, oh my goodness. And then the green above it for the hair, okay. Oops. Okay. Oh look, I'm already getting stuff all over it. I think that, oh my gosh. What if I add a little bit of this maybe to lighten it up? I don't know. I'm so nervous I'm going to ruin my pretty, pretty picture. I want to go super light. Super light, oh my gosh. Don't try, don't try. What do you think so far? Is it looking okay? I know, it's practice. I get scared. I like having the sketch underneath to help with like the tones and stuff. Oh, it looks a lot lighter 
on the camera or the screen now that I'm looking at that. It looks a little darker in person. Well, I guess I could add a little more for shadows. Oh, that's a lot. That's a lot. Maybe water that down. Oh man, now I'm nervous for a darker layer. Ah. It's actually, oh, the paper is holding up pretty well. As long as I'm not using too much water. So what are you doing today, Emma? Are you working on some videos or paintings? Blend that out. That was a little dark. Just had a shower and washed my hair. Aw, so I can dry all pretty and record some videos. Yay! Yay, recording videos. Oh, <laughs> you think it looks great? Thanks. I think it has to do with all the undertone shading why it looks so good. Otherwise, I think it wouldn't be that good. I have actually haven't tried doing a watercolor portrait yet, so this is kind of like my first go at it. I've just been kind of working with um, just the pencil and graphite, trying to get better at the features and stuff. I still can fairly draw like a three-quarter portrait or profile. give her some shading on her lips. Oh my gosh, that's the green. <laughs> Not what I wanted. I wanted to grab the pink. I'm looking at the splash card and I just grabbed what was next to it. Duh. Oh, so you've been practicing gestures lately? Trying to get your proportions better. Yeah, I'm definitely scared to do um, anything more than I had right now. <laughs> I started to do some portraits with um, the hands, some pictures, and I felt like that wasn't coming out very <laughs> good. So I stopped adding hands and just wanted to find pictures with just their head. But I know I'll eventually have to get better at it. 
I'll have to draw them in order to get better because if I ignore them, that's not going to help. I feel like the lips are kind of leaking out into the picture. No, don't do it. slowly ruining my picture. I don't know if I can get rid of that. Or I'm just going to make a muddied mess. Don't do it, don't do it. Touch that anymore. Leave it alone. Okay. Oh, I should probably do it next. Finish that up. So what else is going on? What can we talk about? Maybe like how I'm excited for spring because it's like snowed forever over here. And I'm definitely done with all the snow until next year or technically later this year. I'm so ready for warm weather. What do I have planned for May's art video? Well, I think I'm editing a birthday haul um, of everything that I got for my birthday because I got some new supplies and some equipment that I'm kind of using right now. And I've recorded quite a few things. I don't know what order I'm going to put the rest of them up in, but. I recorded a traveler's notebook, but I can show you that it's finished. So let me see how it shows on the, I don't know if you can see the shimmer. And so you can open it up and you can slide your booklets that you make under these rubber bands like a little clear folder that I made so yeah so I did a video about how I made that yeah I made that <laughs> it's so funny looks good right right so I'm working on filming the booklet for that 
but I finished making that. I just had to edit it. I got some gouache. I'm going to do a video about that. And what else? I don't remember. I had a whole list of stuff I did. I've been recording like crazy because I was just in the mood for it. Thank you. I thought it turned out pretty good too. Okay. Now for the hair. Do you still want me to do this green for the hair? Or should I do it something else? Like a pink or purple? Or the pink. Yeah, I think I really I think I like the pink. Let's see how that looks. Probably gonna be very bright. Oh man, I'm nervous. Maybe start light and then build up the layers. so far? What do you think? Onto her head. Uh, guess it's there now. definitely sucks up the paint and the color so if you're painting and it's dry it'll dry really quick I don't really want a whole bunch of lines so I'm trying to do it fast I think I'm going to do a blue shirt. I really like that blue. And then I'll come back and do some details in the hair. I 
that part was dry. Oh no. It's there. It's stuck there. brush up with water and do this next side of the shirt in one big loop. Yeah, I think it looks like a shadow too, so maybe I should just keep using it very lightly to do the rest of the shadow on the neck, so that way it doesn't look so weird. Ah, maybe the paper's not fully dry, I don't know. That was bad. I hope it doesn't look too bad. There, if I use a paper towel and grab it really quick. How does that look? Doesn't look too blue, I hope not. Maybe scoot it up a little so you can see. Is that better? Okay. Oh yeah. <laughs> look at the creep onto our forehead. brown will go over it, or I could just be possibly ruining it, I don't know. This is practice, right? a bit. Oops, I <laughs> didn't see that. <laughs> no, it looks, well, maybe it still looks that way, hopefully. Trying to dry it off a little. All right, I'm ready to add some darker parts of pink in the hair, like streaks or something. how I thought it would. On camera, I think it looks, or on the screen, I don't know what to say, but I think it looks right there. I don't know, on your end. I might be this dark.
Thank you. I'm glad it looks good. Again with the pink. That lasted a long time. I feel like this side is too light compared to this side. All 
right, so do you think the hair looks pretty good? And I want to do some blue for her eyes. The same blue as the shirt, I think. Yeah, I do think it looks better than the color around the edges. I was just really nervous. I didn't think I could do it, but I think it turned out all right. For my first try, watch, now I'm gonna ruin it by painting her eyes. Oh no, what am I doing? I don't know. <gasps> oh no. Well, now I gotta do both. And this one's probably gonna look better because it's lighter and I should have did that with the first one. Ah. Oh, they do? Okay, good, because it looks dark over here. I, th I think the camera, um, makes it look a lot lighter on the screen because it's actually kind of dark in here um but everything looks pretty bright okay good ah this turned out so good let me there's some lines on the edge i want to erase Oh, look at all my, you can see the smear from the graphite when I probably rub my hand all over it. Well, I will miss you, and I hope you have fun, and we need to chat again soon. You're the only one that talks to me. I don't know if I'll keep streaming. It says three people are watching, but you're the only one commenting, so I don't know. I might call it a day here and maybe pick up again when you can watch, and then I'll do another sketch watercolor piece. I'm so glad you caught me watching it too. <sighs> so I think that's it for this stream and then I'll just have to plan another one. Or me and you can video chat, Emma. Whatever comes first. So, all right. Bye.